Why hello, and welcome to my sample series, where I showcase games for either the PlayStation 4 Pro or the Xbox One X running in 4K and or HDR. This week I'm featuring Halo 3 as part of my ongoing mini-series, I guess, on the Master Chief Collection. I'm going to go through the first hour or so of each of the six games that are now part of that really awesome game that you should probably have if you have an Xbox One. Uh, like I said, this week I'm going to be doing Halo 3. I'm going to play roughly the first hour of this in two parts as YouTube limits my um, HD 4K HDR uploads to about half an hour each. If I go too far above that, then uh, for whatever reason it, they will no longer resolve to their maximum resolution but instead be stuck at 360p. And I don't know why that's the case, but it started over a year ago when I first tried to upload footage of Spider-Man for the PS4. And it's something I've learned to live with. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to do a quick start on Halo 3. And we're going to get started here. This is being recorded in 4K at with HDR at 60 frames a second at about 40 megs a second bitrate. They let me pick. Did I ever tell you that? Choose whichever Spartan I wanted. You know me. I did my research. Watched as you became the soldier we needed you to be. That's like fun. the others, you were strong and swift and brave. A natural leader. But you had something they didn't. Something no one saw but me. Can you guess? Luck. Funny, because I thought Cortana was the ship AI, not an AI specifically designed for a super soldier like was the Master Chief. Whatever. This ain't good. Damn. How far did he fall? Two kilometers. Easy. Stay sharp. Now, interestingly enough, Halo 3 is actually the earliest Corman, game. His armor's locked up. In this um, could have collection. Taken most of the impact. I don't know, Sergeant Major. The explanation is that both the two earlier games, Halo 1 and Halo 2, were remastered um, in this version since their original release. So technically, the version of Halo 1 in this game is from 2011. And the version of Halo 2 in this game is from 20. Uh, Radio for Vito. 14. Heavy lift gear. And Halo 3 not did not here. get a remaster. Yeah, you're not. Oh, crazy fool. Why do you always jump? One of these days, you're gonna land on something as stubborn as you are. And I don't do bits and pieces. Where is she, Chief? Where's Cortana? Don't make a girl a promise. If you know you can't keep it. She stayed behind. Barbara, make it quick. Sorry, sir. Your armor's still in partial lockdown. Yeah, Look right. up here, sir. Okay. Now down here? Good. Everything checks out, Sergeant Major. Kick off the training wheels, Corporal. He's good to go. <laughs> look up, look down. You're good to go. Chief, wait! The Arbiter's with us! Come on now. We've got enough to worry about without you two trying to kill each other. Were it so easy? We must go. The brutes have our scent. 
then they must love the smell of green. The reintroduction of the classic assault rifle there. My, uh, Halo 3 gets you into uh, actual gameplay much quicker than Halo 2 did. Which is good. Because there was quite a bit of um, cutscene in Halo 2 as I showcased last week. So I should be able to get a little bit further. Though if I remember correctly, you spend an awful lot of time in this initial forest area. So you can see the Arbiter is with us, as with as is all of the elites, basically, who basically rebelled against the Covenant, or more or less they were kicked out. If I remember the events of Cable 2 correctly, which perhaps I don't. Bravo team, this is Johnson. We got him. Fall back to the extraction point. Over. Roger that. Reynolds out. <laughs> Well, yeah, like I said, this is technically the oldest game in this collection here, and it's quite a significant downgrade visually, I guess, from Halo, the Halo 2 remaster. But it still looks pretty good for a 2007 game, which makes it 13 years old now. This is still running at 4K. In fact, uh, Halo 3 running on an Xbox One by backwards compatibility. The regular version actually ran at 4K. And they did that before the Master Chief collection was um, added to the... Got the 4K HDR patch. That guy did not look good at all. Where is that guy? Look at this guy. What's wrong with your skin there, buddy? I'm glad I did not actually have a grenade on me as I tried to pull left trigger to zoom in. Now, the Brutes are introduced in Halo 2 as sort of follies for the Covenant, for the Covenant Elites. played through much of the um, Halo 2 campaign as a Covenant Elite known as the Arbiter, who is now fighting alongside you right now, or fighting alongside the Master Chief. You can tell that they were clearly trying to do a whole bunch of stuff with this game. This was the first Halo game of the Xbox 360 era. Although I remember when it came out, it wasn't really well received all that much on the visual front. I think people expected more of the first Halo game on the Xbox 360. It was not like a technical or graphical artistic stunner when it came out. It wasn't a showpiece for the hardware, really. When we are victorious, all who serve the prophets will be punished. Remember games like Gears of War and The Elder Scrolls IV Oblivion being much more impressive looking. I think people were just waiting for this game to come out to finish the fight. Sleepers! Take them out. Nice and quiet. Let's 
sleeping on the job, eh? I'm gonna get myself a carbine. Is that all of them? Now they're starting to wake up. Imagine if they were, I'd be messed up. Getting low on ammo here. Thought I saw a carbine lying on the ground. Eh. Let's get one of these things. They're kind of fun. But I can't raise problem. You find them, get them to the extraction point. No. I guess forward we go. Wherever that is. Here we go. Come. The landing zone is this way. Tell me its location. Kiss my. The needler is kind of effective against brutes. Actually, the needler got a significant upgrade. I feel in this game. Pin this down. Kill my man. I always feel like the Needler is looked at the, the same disdain that the Bio Rifle was from Unreal Tournament. Yeah, a weapon that most people wish didn't exist, but I like it. This is technically not the same pistol from Halo 1, as it's actually a Magnum. You can zoom in with it, but you cannot shoot with a zoomed in perspective. Out over here. Something about a river? I'll take point. Ah. Could you sacrifice me to complete your mission? Could you watch me die? That Sir, looked a little okay? grainy there. <laughs> Game has some fear style elements there. There we go. This is what I want. Don't let him escape. That's right. Halo 1 had the battle rifle. Halo, Halo 1 had the assault rifle. Halo 2 had the battle rifle. This game has both. And it has deployables too. I forgot about these. These things that lasted for this and Halo Reach. And then never again. <laughs> Which is fine.
grenade? Ah, they've deployed a shield. Grenade. If I can grab that. Reinforcement. Grab some more ammo for it too. Thought I saw one lying around here somewhere. Maybe I didn't. Oh well. Thank you, British guy. Do you miss your days in the RAF? The Banshees will return. Hurry, back into the jungle. Chief, can you hear? I, I kind of looked up there thinking it was one of those plants from, from Half-Life 2. Kind of an odd instinct to suddenly have, but whatever. Nice. Ah, guess your allies are actually somewhat effective in combat in this game. Good to know. Come on, you dumb apes! You want breakfast? You gotta catch him! I don't think I know how to deploy that shield that I have. I would assume it's on left bumper, but I don't actually know. Let me take a quick peek. Sorry about this, I don't really have much time to do something like this. Use equipment X. Okay. LB is lead mode left bumper. Left bump weapon, I mean. It's a uh, get a different selection of weapons here. And let's deploy this thing. Now I know how to do that. Sergeant Major went this way, Chief. Through the cave. Just follow the road flares, I guess. What do we got? Besides a cutscene, of course. See how they beat their trap? I will help you spring it.
and the little night vision thing on the scope is in fact working. Kind of a neat little touch. Kind of a cowardly tactic there, but I'll take it. Okay, what is shooting me from there? Get out of here. That's what I wanted. That's... You could probably safely jump down to here now. Ah. The little guys can use grenades too. You'll join your friend soon. Ow. Gotta watch out for those hammers. Let's see where the game checkpoints me, actually. Not that far, I guess. I definitely should have taken that guy out with a sniper rifle when I had the chance. Oh, well. Try this again, this time with a little less dying. How's that sound? <laughs> ah. Dag damn it. I didn't see him. Let's try a different route. Especially if he's right there. Actually, I think that's a different guy, different brute, and there he is. Reinforcement. There we go. Got him, finally. Alright, we're out of ammo here. Switch to something else. That was a bad grenade throw there. Okay, that that guy was holding two grenades. Gotta take him out before he takes you out. The grunts in this game, these games have always been a source of humor and comedy. Or desperation. Maybe the Covenant would have been better off with more, with fewer of these guys, oops, and more elites and brutes. But something blew me up.
this game, I think they introduce two new grenade types and thus limit the number of uh, grenades you could hold of each type to two. So you get the same number of grenades, assuming you have one of each type, but if you have a particular preference, you end, end up getting half as many of your favorite kind. This isn't as fun as it looks. Cut the power! get the carbine here. Huh. Why did I think that would work? Um, inbound. Stay alive. Yeah, maybe being inside here is a good idea. You take out these guns with enough fire. How about if I deploy this thing? Focus! Phantom! There we go. Everyone down. Scratch one phantom. Guess the pelicans are more powerful than the phantoms. Scratch two. Well, with that, I'm going to put a pause to this video. This is part one of my 4K HDR look at roughly the first hour of Halo. Halo 3 of the Master Chief Collection. I will see you back here for part two, and I'm going to get this video an uploading. So, see you soon.